Let's get it. Yo, what's up, boys? Oh, shoot. What's up, what's up, what's up? Walking Dead Part 2. Sheesh. Let's get it. Absolute 10 out of 10 game. Let's get it. Uh. Turn the music off. I know I still have to move some things, so webcam. No, no, no. Game capture. Yeah, yeah. Go auto. And then we go capture specific window. Um. Should be capturing it. I would think. Let me take this off. Give me a second. Yes, thank you. Game capture, add. Let's move this down. Why is it not? Give me a second. I think it's because I don't have it loaded up all the way. Let's see if it's up now. So game capture, auto.
Okay, I'll just have to do screen capture. So it's status. So we're on start for help. Let me uh, change that real quick, actually. Let me change that real quick. Okay, live screen, boom, boom. Okay, let's get it. Episode two, starved for help. Now, like I've said in part one, I have I've played the whole season one and I've watched the other ones, um, but I do want this on the channel, so that's why I am playing it. Previously on The Walking Dead. I know who you are. Oh, I Watch got another out. good one for you. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. You get it. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Hmm. Oh my God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. That's tough. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Three months later. body kid damn it what'd they get this time uh, looks like a rabbit <sighs> well that's another meal lost wait I can pause this right I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me. Oh, wait. The game doesn't look I have like no food, regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. We'll manage. Maybe. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's hand Okay, I always do this at the beginning, but let me shrink my camera a little bit. I don't want it to be in the way too much. Just a little bit, though. Resume. Handling rations. 
Levy knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor end. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. He's got a wife and son to look out for. And they're safest in a big group. Going out on his own will get them all killed. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? Give your opinion. What's the old that? guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. He thinks I'm a danger to the group, and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Hmm. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Okay. Ah! Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! This is the shot. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher, we'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off, get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got what away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a bear trap out here? Oh. I don't know, man. It's okay. I wasn't We're looking. not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. Lee, this is fucked up. We've gotta help. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. Was he bitten? Bitten? No, I swear. Hurry, please, hurry. Lee, this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Oh no. I think it's time to leave. Shit, walkers! It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. There has to be a way out of this. this is bad. Really bad. Just get me out. There's hey, gotta be please, something I can do. Screaming. We're gonna be surrounded any minute. Please! Get me out. Oh, Try to cut the chain! I'm gonna have to get you out. No, no, no! Try the trap again! Anything, please! You said anything, buddy. Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> yeah, that would hurt. Ah, <laughs> Ow. Damn it, Lee just cut off his fucking leg. We don't have time for that. I'm s ah. Ah. Oh God. Shit. Is he? He passed out. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. He's just bleeding to death. <laughs> Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! <laughs> no! 
so stupid. Yeah, let's let's walk backwards. Yeah. Going hungry. Achievement unlocked. Episode two. Starved for help. It's open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on! Come oh on! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, the hell what What's going on? We have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken! Lee! I, I don't know! Lee! What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here! What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What's no, your mouth? I don't! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Jesus Christ. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. Right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, hmm. are you? Um, uh, no. Fine. You guys fight it out then. He said, I don't know. Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You, know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. Kenny's right. Yeah, you're in charge of the food and the schedules, but you're not in charge of people's lives. Really? You weren't there. Lee made a choice. End of story. Look, once Katja patches that guy up, you can kick him out of here. Send him out on their own. I couldn't care less. But they at least deserve a fighting chance against the walkers. And for the record, Kenny wanted to leave those people behind. If Kenny would pull his head out of his ass for five seconds, <laughs> he'd realize that I make these decisions to protect his family. We simply don't have enough food. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Yeah, see ya, Jim. You know what? If you think I'm doing such a shitty job, then you do it. That's all the food we have for today. You decide who gets to eat. Lily. No, I'm serious. Pick up that food and start handing it out. You see how it feels to Jesus, not have enough food annoying. for everyone. We only have four food items for 10 hungry people. He knows he ain't getting any. <laughs> I wonder if there's anybody that actually gave uh, 
the old man some after what he's done. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up, quit being such a pansy. Jesus, he's annoying. At least the key have something to keep them occupied. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sure. When did you lose it? I had it a couple days ago. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Okay. Okay, Ben's not getting any. Okay. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um... Enjoy it. You deserve it. <laughs> hey, Doc. How about a little food? <laughs> hey, Here. there you go. Yeah! Oh, man, I'm so hungry! Want something to eat? Here. Me? How about you? You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? I'm okay. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. I know I said it didn't matter why you saved me instead of Doug, but... You don't owe me anything, Carly. Wait. Uh... He... Sleeping any better? No. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Drugstore? Yeah. Back in a bit. Back in a bit. Oh, wait. Shoot. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. The coast does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. You told Kenny leaving for the coast was a good idea. Want something to eat? Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. I mean, he's not doing anything, but... Hmm. Uh, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Okay, so Carly doesn't want it. How's it going, Lee? From up here, it looks like you're playing favorites. <laughs> yeah, and I could care less. Here, eat something. Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Is he gonna be okay? I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. 
You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. Hmm. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Okay, no food for you then. Chimp. I give it to Mark. Here, eat something. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Hmm. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Come on, Larry, give it a rest. I'm sure Lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group. Is that what you told him? Yeah, that's right. And what are you gonna do about it? Hmm. Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. <laughs> I don't know why you'd say that, but okay. Not such an easy job, is it? Never said it was. No, it's pretty easy, to be honest. I don't know. I don't it's know pretty, how you have the strength pretty to do easy, this every day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with Yo, me. Yo, what's up, Blue? How you doing? Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out? What happened to my food? Well, There's you. none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. True. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Katja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? What the? Oh. Move, move. Oh, I don't really know how you're stuck. Okay? Yeah. Thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! You said he wasn't bitten! What? We asked you point blank was he bitten, and you said no! He wasn't! Well, your not bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? 
What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. It's your mom. Oh. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know. I... All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Dead. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax! <laughs> Me and my brother, we... We just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. You're outnumbered here. Just turn around and go back. Okay, that's fine. Uh, but but you'd really be helping out a fellow survivor if, if you could part with some extra gas before we leave. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look... We own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going it's with legit. you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk. Let me make sure the stream is not dying. Okay. It says we're not dying, so... Butter and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. You think they'd want me for a leader? Sure. Everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Barry knows. Great. That can't hmm. be easy. Clementine knows. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I couldn't lie to her. What exactly did happen with the senator? It was an accident. I mean, I, I pretty much knew about the affair. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, mm. Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Enough to defend ourselves. Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Hmm. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. 
No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you! Fucking you knew we were hungry, and are. you guys were keeping it up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's more. Yeah, and you know what? More we ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry, Danny and I got you covered if something happens. But let's just wait this out and hope they move on. Fuck you! <gasps> Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Dead. Didn't he have a crossbow? Why would you not grab that though? Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. Yeah. Ever have any accidents? Nah. It's safer here than out there. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. Yo, what's up, FNAF? It's worth protecting. Hence what's up, all Ellen? the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Guys, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John. Yeah, what's up, guys? Welcome to the St. John stream. Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farmhands were from Macon. They grow them good there. We got a few the game. more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place right is now. pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead your group? We all work together. Plus, we've got plenty of people with yeah, military stream, experience. Guys. Well, that's good to hear. That motel ain't the safest place. Now, Yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this game. This game is one of my favorites. Uh, Now, I, you guys probably don't know this because I've said it a, a couple times. Um... Okay, so Alan, uh, you probably don't want to be back on the episode because I don't think I'll cry because I've I've played part one, and so I've played all of season one and I've watched the other seasons. Um, it's just I wanted it to be on the channel, so that's why I'm streaming it. You know, I wanted to like I wanted one of my favorite games to be on the channel. You know, so that's why I've been streaming it. But yeah, this is one of my favorite games. This game's really, for it being back in the day, you know, it's great. Now that y'all are here, you we'll this make before. sure you're safe nice. and comfortable. Yeah, just try not to say stuff in case new people join. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. Yeah, because th th this game is one of my favorite games. Uh, and, you know, I just wanted, I wanted to be able to look back on the channel because I don't know how many more times I'll play this probably not that many more because I was debating on even playing it a second time because I don't like playing games that I already know what's gonna happen but you know yeah man Alan I, I appreciate you uh, being in the, the chat man yeah yeah um I have like everything uh, I stream on twitch too I have TikTok. I have discord um I don't know if you have twitch I don't know if I have a link to my discord but I know it's on my Twitch. I don't know if I have a link to my Discord on YouTube. But yeah, this game, this game's a 10 out of 10 for sure. Nice, FNAF. Nice, man. Yeah, th this this is one of my favorite games, though. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Nice. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Yeah, if you guys enjoy the stream, just consider uh, subscribing and liking the stream. And if you don't subscribe or like, then it's all good. I just hope that you guys enjoy the stream. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybell will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Talking about the cow. Your cow is sick? What's she? We have a vet, but we could bring her here. But we can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! 
Maybe our whole group could come for the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A big feast for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Go help her out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself. Oh, I appreciate it, Fanaf. See you in a while. Uh, no, Alan, I haven't played Life is Strange. Mark, Lee, why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled I in, I could use some it. help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. See, that would It'd not be, be safe. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generator like, bro, this is a run baby dry. fence. Come get me when you're ready. You betcha. This, this is place a baby is fence. incredible. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Okay, well that's spoiling it. You try not to spoil, please. Um... Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe you think as they're like telling it. us. Right. Obviously. See, anything. I know it's not that big of a spoil because, you know, they're not a main person, but, you know, just in case newer people come in. You're talking about this game? Yeah, um, I'm just the type of person where I can play this like these type of games like campaign games i play them once and i'm pretty much done but you know like i said i wanted it to be on the channel so i played it again or i'm playing it again i think it's safe but is it safe enough for the kids i noticed a broken swing over there let me see if Not anybody's a... texting oh shoot big deal but maybe there's other this. things uh i need to fix my okay no one said anything on twitch Want to start a new game? Should I keep playing The Walking Dead or a new game? Can you recommend me a game? Like a campaign game? What you're saying? Or are you talking about any game? Because it's kind of hard to narrow down what you like. Because if it's any game, I don't know if you like shooters. You know, I don't know if, you know. So, is it a, you talking about like a campaign game? You try to make an art on this game? Is that what you're talking about? Maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence Season perimeter four, it's sounds great. like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. It is, it is. All right, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. I kind of like games like The Walking Dead. Too bad um, it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. I think Kids you would used like, to like uh, that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. I think you would like. <laughs> I'll bet. What's it called? If you're talking about zombie games. Mind if I fix it? Sure. That'd be great. Give me a second. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. You love Make making choices. Oh, and so you're talking about Saint like John's choice know games? We can pull our weight around here. So. A choice game that I haven't played, but I've heard from like a million people uh, that's good is uh, Detroit Become Human, I think. I'm pretty sure that's a choice choosing game. But I love playing zombie games. This is too big right now, but if I can find something to cut it down to Oh, size. yeah. There's a, there's a new game. It's called. Um, what's the game called? It's a. Uh, It's a it's a new one. It's um the the quarry. You might like the quarry. That one's a new one. I watched a play. Th I I've started two playthroughs and I'm not through either this of them. Might make a good seat for the swing. Yet. Might make a good seat for the swing. You saw. Hmm. 
Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Well, yeah, if you're talking yeah, about like zombie go games, right ahead. Left 4 Dead might not be your type of game because it's older, but this is also older. Um, so maybe like Back for Blood, you might like that, but it's not a choice choosing game. <clears throat> or World War Z, it just depends, you know, if you're like, if you like zombie games. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back in the motel that you folks are pretty well armed. Been stockpiling, huh? <laughs> yeah. If anyone tries to fuck with us, they'll regret it. Well, protecting your people is important, but in my experience, having that um, Detroit become human, or Back for Blood. Zombie games are your type. Yeah, I, lo I love zombie games. I can type a. Uh, here, I'll type a few games. Um Give me a second. Any type, yeah. I love zombie games too. Um, what's another one? Yeah, I don't know if like Call of Duty's the type of game for you. Let me make sure no one said anything on Twitch. Okay. Let's get it. That many guns around is when people get dangerous. We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, yeah, no, we've made similar deals with other folks. Uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on. Looking for the people they lost contact with. An electric fence is enough to keep out walkers? Walkers? <laughs> is that what you call them? <laughs> That's good. Uh, the old one wouldn't have, but Mac, he was our foreman. He figured out how to amp it up with the generators. We used to sit out here some nights and watch the sons of bitches sizzle and pop when they got too close. Closest thing to entertain. Yeah, you have a good day too, Alan. These generators are enough to power the whole dairy? We got lots, and we gotta keep trading for fuel as much as we can, but they all work together to do the trick. You know, like us. Mark and I can help you with that perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walker in about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. Well, that'd be great. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. Man, the, the soundtrack in this game is so good. So how's the place we'll looking? Go. Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? Give me a second. Um. Yo, what's up, Noah? How you doing, man? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but I appreciate let's see the what follow. it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. What's up with you telling him what I said about him thinking I'm dangerous? Look, you said it. You even admitted it right to him. I try to be civil at least. He's too busy being cranky to notice. Hmm. You? There's one. Yeah. Ugh. I use uh, Streamlabs up Yes, It's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Maybe the St. John oh. boys are using this guy for target practice? 
Uh, poor guy. I don't know who got him first, the arrow or the fence. Either way, hope he was already dead. Disgusting. Can you imagine? Come on. I'm sure there's still a few more. At least it's not like... Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. God, can you imagine not having to worry about the walkers Good anymore? in you. I'm French, so sorry for my English. Hey, you're good, Noah. Um... Yeah, well, it's useless without gas. We might need food. How you doing? But the St. John's need gas, You too. like this game? Not many drivers these days, Lee. We could scrounge up a year's worth of gas. Easy. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty Three well. Three years worth, huh? We've got enough people to take this place by force if we have to. Sheesh, Lee. You sound like Kenny. There's another one. Being a diabetic I and see. playing zombie games is like a vibe for me. I just love the the uh, history with zombie games, you know? And like, you know, you gotta survive and stuff. And I don't play too many older games, and this is one that, you know, you never get used to the smell. A couple you? years ago, <laughs> nope. Um, Christ, I can't stop uh, thinking about dinner. So we got an Xbox 360 with a crap ton of games. It's not easy in a certain way kids, and for free. It's all that's keeping and me on my feet. We kept right it now, and uh, we'll go ask for more to eat after this and is done. All right. It had I this, it and I played it on the Xbox 360, and man, Come it was on. just... I think I see where they're getting in. There's nothing better this than playing an older game when you don't have... Because I didn't have internet good. at the time. Come on, help me get this thing back in place and so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other... So, so I didn't have internet, right, at the time, and we got the Xbox 360 and stuff, and I was playing this game, and I was just sitting there, you know, like, on my chair, just... Because when if it, it's different, you know, when you're on the Xbox 360, it's like back in the day. It's like you know, and when you're playing offline, when you're playing a game like this, it's just different. So I was doing that, and I played this, and it was just great. I used to have an Xbox 360, two of them. Nice. Sorry. No. Nice. Good idea. <clears throat> yeah, I still have one. Give me a second. I'll see if you text anything, Noah. Wait, I'll have to do this real quick. Uh, I don't really hear you. The song. The song game is too loud. A little help here, Lee. It is. The three. If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna oh. happen. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Lee. We yeah, don't yeah, have yeah, all yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, Mark, shut up. Oh, shoot. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he Yo, turn I appreciate the, the subs on YouTube, guys. What the Sorry, I'm, I'm like talking while this is happening. Get down, you asshole! Jesus! Mark just got bodied. Now you're fucked. Who the fuck is that? No idea. Fuck. Now what? With the fence on, that gate is our only way out. Show yourself. What about our arrangement? You need to I already got one of you. <laughs> I already got one of you. Get closer. Wait, hurry up. Can we go past him? Oh, we can. Try to lure him in the open. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. He's got his aim sucks. Shit, that hurts. 
What happened? Shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move it. You asshole! Already got one of you. <laughs> Already got one of you. Where do you think you're going? Uh. Leaving. Another one? How many of those things did we push down? Do this you really think you fuck with us? You hmm. Oh shoot. <laughs> you. you okay? Yeah. Fair. Come on. The gate's right there. Give it to food. Nice. The They're away. Let's get out of here. Of you. I already got one of you. Oh yeah, let's leave the door open. Go ahead and run. That door's not even closed. Yeah, FNF, just try not to say too much stuff, man. Lee, what's wrong? There was a goddamn ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? The bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out, but god damn it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? <laughs> I think we can yeah, see that. I'm fine. I should just pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be Sorry, what I gotta... kind of shit is this? We ran into some people on the way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems. Here, sorry, I'll see you know what did you say anything? Um Did you see The Walking Dead? Uh the movie or or the show I met? Are you talking about the game? Yeah, yeah, I've seen the game. I've played uh I've played season one and I've watched the other seasons. Hand. We were able to get them to stop I just by wanted to be on the deep. channel for you YouTube. About these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. So much for your deal. Those oh, shitheads broke the agreement. Look, I'm sorry, Lee. If I had any inkling they were going to give you guys trouble, well, we would have gone out there with you. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those me for people, but we will not chat. stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're going to let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that... See, the only thing is with talking so much, because I, I try to respond as much as I can... The only thing with playing this game and trying to respond is the fact that, like, I want to read, like, all the comments that you say. It's just a little hard to because, like, I'm trying to play throughout the game and try to get, like, this part done while trying to, like, read. But I don't kind of want to talk over what they're saying. So, like, I kind of want to pause it. But it's kind of, like, annoying when I pause it, you know? Bandit camp, come find us. I don't mind Bandits, talking, though. Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe. It's just if I don't answer this place you right away, then. a lot safer than that motor in. That's why. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. Hmm. What we need to do is find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try yeah. to make friends with Andy. So and I don't mind you talking so much. It's well, just that's when easy. I play a game like I this, it's hard to talk to you. My ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. 
Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. Hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Sorry, I don't have my laptop. Like, my laptop won't connect to the internet. I don't know why. And I'm trying to, like, multitask, go to Twitch and YouTube. Because I have YouTube pulled up on my phone. I need the TV series. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've, I've watched it a long time ago. And I've started to just rewatch it with my mom. We're at, like, season four right now. And we've been, like, uh, slowly uh, watching, like, a few episodes every, like, week or so. Need to go. I'm sorry. Bye. No, I pre. If you're still here, if you haven't left yet, Noah, I appreciate the the follow, man. I really do appreciate it. Yeah, I appreciate you uh, hanging out for a little bit. I stream pretty much every day though, so if you guys actually want to start watching me, um, I do play a bunch of different games. But if not, I understand. Not everyone new that comes to the channel is gonna watch. That thing keeps a fence electrified. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Yeah, I'm starting to actually make YouTube videos the 22nd, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be fun, but nerve wracking. I made a video if you guys want to go check it out on my YouTube. I made it the other day. That's only if you want to start watching me though. If there's not Kinda. enough room in the house for all of us, I guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Um, so I'll not talk in the chat because I'm playing. Nice. You're good. Looks you like can a talk. It's just... for the cow. I'm just saying, like, it's harder for me to just instantly. You know, read your message. Lee, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. Yeah, well, how are you going to know what's going to happen? I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid if you ask me. Lee. I know you and Kenny are friends, but you recognize that he's not the right person to lead this group, don't you? Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good <laughs> if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. And not giving my dad food. That was cold. Really? Hey. Really? Hey, uh. Can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. <clears throat> Does he treat you like that, too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... He's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened know. him, you know? Yeah, he's In bitter this, and hateful, everyone. but that's yes. all just to protect himself and me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably going to keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. Where? 
Think our little arrangement with them was a good idea? A little late to be asking that now, don't you mm. think? Dad's right. Let's just wait for dinner. And then if Mark is feeling up to it, we leave. I don't want to push our luck here. Now, now, let's not be hasty. I'm gonna go check things out. Just... Yo, I appreciate the follow, uh... Lil' K-pop, what's up? How you doing today? Just don't get too nosy. Have These you played kinds this game before? Are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting us thrown out in our asses. Hmm. Okay, we're done talking to her. Yo, I appreciate everyone that's uh, subbed on YouTube or followed on Twitch. Moss How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. <laughs> you saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. <laughs> Who the fuck are these people in the woods? <laughs> we don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Yeah. Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Kind of annoyed that I have to keep doing this, but it's fine. Um, hey, what's up, G? Not gonna lie, Larry. Kind of look like the Chad guy from the meme. Oh, he does. A little bit, yeah, yeah. Have you uh, played this game? If you haven't played this game, you need to really be careful for s people in chat spoiling because ran I was my my friend that I got to play this game. Uh, I I got him to play it because it was on sale, and I was watching him and I'm a mod in his stream and uh, someone joined and said like what happened at the end of the game. Of season one I was like bro I was like freaking out I'm like do not look at the chat like it was his first time playing I was like bro I timed the guy out I was like nah you know what I'm banning this guy screw that he's just gonna come back as soon as he's done and then say it again you grew up on the walking dead yeah some peeps wild in yeah it's a, that's why it's kind of bad to stream this I might make some videos on this instead of streaming all the parts, but I don't know. But yeah, welcome to the stream. I appreciate the follow. Um, if I don't read your message right away, it's because I have to manually go to this. Because the thing is, I'm watching YouTube chat on my phone, right? And if I switch to Twitch chat, it like re it like it loads to where I see what happens after I load in. So like I won't see anybody's messages on Twitch beforehand, which is annoying. Let's do it. So I have to do that. Every I'll stay time. here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Little Clem. <laughs> She's just like, see ya. See anything? Not yet. Yeah, so if I don't uh, answer you for a little while, here. like a little bit, it's gotta then be close. That's why. I'll make sure to read everything that you type, though. If you're still here. Or even if you're not, I'll still read it. Here. I don't try to give anything away, oh, though, shit. just in case new people you do watch. It? I just wanted this game on the channel for YouTube so I can look back at it. Because, like I've said, this game is a 10 out of 10. Especially for being an older game. Sneak up to the camp.
You see anybody? Stay on your guard. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. There he sounds. <laughs> Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna go check out the tent. God. <laughs> Headshot. Clear. This camp's too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Look at bottles. Empty. But it looks like someone's been eating out of these recently. Huh? Nothing but fumes. Shit. Imagine. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? <laughs> Not unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <sighs> I'll pass. Dang, bro, why are you dissing on the empty cans? What the heck? Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. Hmm. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Is there literally food being made in here or what? Just water. Here in a second, I'll look back at Twitch chat. Nothing. Empty. Yeah, if my laptop would connect to the internet, I'd be able to just look at both, but it's annoying. Because we changed our router. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I always say good. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. <laughs> yeah, I appreciate the follow on Twitch, uh, K-pop. Appreciate anybody that subbed on YouTube too. I appreciate it. Oh man! <laughs> the hell? Don't you fucking move! Shit! Put your guns down. <laughs> I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We had a deal. 
You people broke it first. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are, but they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. <laughs> you think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice, soft arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. <laughs> Killing everywhere. So Take stupid. all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for us. Oh. God damn it! Well, thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. <sighs> Thank you for shopping at Save Lots. It's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. <laughs> Come on. You gonna kiss the crosswall or what? a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Denny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. Handled it. Got her on lockdown. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. She always does that stupid motion. Like, hmm, what's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They have different ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry, and people get a little stir-crazy when their tummy's empty. <laughs> and Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Little Clementine. I'm here. I'm just on phone and have you open in window chatting on. Yes, we're monsters. Casually flex muscles.
<laughs> Casually shoots her in the head. Multi tool. That should be handy. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, son. <laughs> it's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. She's been in here the entire time. I think she would have already pet her. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> hey there, Andy. Yeah. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Thanks. Yep. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. <laughs> Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! Yep, I'm cracked I on the sticks. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Yep. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? I don't think so, Clem. Not the way the world is now. I just... Uh, I don't think I could do that. Oh, maybe when the world gets better, then. Maybe. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? <laughs> nah, but you go on ahead. She looks skinny. Nah, I'm not gonna talk to that to duck. You found it too, huh? <laughs> Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? <laughs> I'll protect You're being her no matter stupid. what. I know That's... you will. Look, that guy with Kachi, Max him in the what's head. his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd mm -hmm. you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> what? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly. 
Have a peek inside and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the Yeah, just break it off with the... Damn shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? No, oh, we're just chatting. What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Uh, we'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. D don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Right away, Doc. Distract Andy to get him out of the barn. It looks pitch black out there. Well, not pitch black, but it looks so dark when you're in there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. There you go. Ow! Damn it! I think it's moving fast. <laughs> I think it's moving fast. <clears throat> that thing is on too tight for my bare hands. There, that should do it. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Hmm. No, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, dog. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. <laughs> stupid. Stupid sound effect. See, it's so dark outside when you're in here. Let's get it. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Imagine. They don't want me to come. Wow. Messed up. Dinner time. Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, Brenda, you wow. are an angel. How Excuse boy. a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, See, how this would they be able is to get a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. Walkers aren't getting through that thing. Okay, we'll check out Mark. What the hell? What do they need so much morphine for? I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Musty as hell. Candles. Smart. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? Creepy. Mark ain't even laying on the bed. Huh? Lee. Mark. What the hell happened? Uh, brothers. What the hell happened to your bags, man? Don't eat dinner. Clementine. Run. Go. Clementine. No. Uh. Huh? Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. What the hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always yeah, something just keep with beating. this guy. Just keep eating. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We got to think about living. An arrow that to the down, shoulder. Honey. How is Growing that Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. We outnumber you. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways. 
one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! Imagine. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? The fucking black Put fuck. your guns down! We're walking you out of go here! Near my fucking Mommy, family! I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Somebody do something! What? Lee? Lee? Why would I say that? <laughs> yeah, let's grab the kid. I'll kill you! Who's coming to dinner? Open up! I will tear you fuckers you apart with my bare hand! We gotta find another way out of here! <laughs> Yo, shit! <laughs> fucking bastard! Oh. Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the Lee, goddamn God, door stop. down! It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. Somebody, no. The rest some of us did, did goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Okay, really? You okay, Clementine? They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker! We gotta get the fuck out of here! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Larry the Lobster. <laughs> You're worse than the walkers! Dad, please! Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! <laughs> Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. <clears throat> I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! Open up, goddammit! No, you're not worth the energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. Settle down! I'll rip your goddamn heads off! <laughs> and make you swallow them! <laughs> Come on! I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, uh, Easy! Oh, God. Dad? No! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! We'll mourn him later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. You remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. We gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee, I'm right about this. I know you've got my back. You always do. God damn it, Lee, I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. 
Wake up. Wake up. Come on. No, I don't care. You're right, Kenny. Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't care. I don't see. I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! It's the only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! He was dead, Clementine. But what if he wasn't? He was, I, I promise. Shh. I know, I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. Let's talk to Kenny. You, uh, you think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. What now? You got any ideas? The air conditioner. There might be a duck behind it. Oh, God. What are they doing to catch you a duck? God only knows. They there probably ought to be did. an air duck behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh uh. Here, let me see if anybody said anything on Twitch. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. I know you hate Kenny and me too, but he did what he had to so we can all go on living. For what? He's got his family, and you've got Clementine. I've got nothing. You left me with nothing. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Uh, hey, any idea where his <clears throat> pocket he keeps his change in? You fucking vulture. My mother's. Don't worry. I'm not taking it. I don't know why we would want that. Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. 
60 cents. That's how we do. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. I wonder what effect they use to do that. Well, there's our way out, me. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. I know you're brave enough. I'm scared. Remember the treehouse? You held out for days. And I saved your life. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Dead. Are you okay? Did anyone see you? No, but there's a man outside. Libby, we gotta go. Leave me alone. Wait, I can see him. It's not safe in here. For God's sake, Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Human slaughterhouse. Yeah, you. So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Outside the barn. Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Uh, sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Pick one to keep and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep alive? Not the kid. There's enough meat on the tray. Uh, oh, I know, Mabel. This is hey, my favorite keep your eye too. On. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. See where he is now. Lee, focus. 
Jeeves, where's Danny? Okay, I didn't look up enough. Are you kidding me? This is my first time dying. Oh, shoot. can live cannibalism is not the answer aren't the walkers eating enough of us you gotta keep me alive if you kill me the meat gets tainted you can't eat it you're already tainted you ain't gonna kill me just like he didn't kill Jolene you don't have what it takes <laughs> fucking coward ah! This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you! Fuck you, Lee. You and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive? Fucking asshole. You kill him, then. Oh, God! Don't hurt him! That's Katja! Please, no! Lily, please, keep her safe. I'm having a bad, bad day. It's a lot time that I get from Kenny! Carly. Carly! Me? Ow! Shh! Is everyone okay? We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. They attacked us! I knew it. I told you we couldn't trust them. Shit! Yeah. How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us! Is everyone else okay? They've still got Doc and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, mm. we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. I left Danny in the bar. He got what he deserved.
Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. Ah, uh, Killer Lee! Just let me go. Little Marky Mark. To the rescue. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Let her go, Brenda. Please, listen to him. I'll do it! Please. Kill you, Lee. Yeah, 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 sure you don't. Please don't make this any worse. Just stop. Okay, how would you not be able to hear Mark though? I said, don't move, asshole! Don't you fucking hurt him! Oh my god! Let him go, goddammit! Oh. That ain't gonna happen! Andy, don't! Shut up! Ah. <sighs> Andy! Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done! Brought this on yourself. No, uh-uh. You did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves mm. safe. Got a shot. Why is she not shooting? Jesus. Holy. What the? Lily, help. Gonna watch me die like what Away from me, Lee. Get back here and finish this, Lee. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee. Yeah. 
Let's go. Fight like a dairy farmer. Hey Lee, I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? We should have known something was up. How the hell do we foresee that? Come on, Lee. I don't know. I really don't. Katja managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <clears throat> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready to roll. I want you to come with us. I mean it. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Jesus, Wait, where was she? Like, way in the back? Those bad people dead? No. They're alive and suffering. They were very bad people. But if they die, it won't be because I killed them. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. the car slowly. Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> hmm. Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. Clementine and I don't want any part of this. We're starving. 
Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay, what have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. <laughs> what? We have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? Hmm. You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Shit. It's not stealing if you need it. Achievement. Next time on The Walking Dead. Making is done, pal. Ain't nothing left. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lee, I need you to back me up on this. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phases it. It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This no, is good, crazy! Pana. I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out! I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! <laughs> Chop David's leg off. You and 84% of players chopped his leg off. Interrogation shot Jolene. You and 87% of players had Danny Shooter. Helped kill Larry. You and 31% of players helped kill Larry. Revenge killed both of the St. John brothers. You and 82% of players didn't kill both brothers. Jesus. Um, stole food from the car. You and 44% of players didn't steal. Dang. Okay, well, that was part two. Um, usually I stream and I'll like stream and stream like for four or six hours. But uh, when I do games like this that are like storyline games, I kind of just want this to be in that stream. So uh, I don't know if I'll stream something later. Probably not because I want to record some more stuff. Uh, 
because I'm starting to do YouTube videos on the 22nd, so so tomorrow. So I want to record another another video. Um, but yeah, this was fun. Um, I love this game. Uh, like I've said, 10 out of 10 game. Uh, if anybody hasn't played it, you should definitely play it. Um, even though it's an older game, it's not that much. I think it's like 15 bucks, and when it's on sale, it's like six on Steam. But yeah, um, this was fun. Um, shoot. I'll probably just sit through here and watch this go by. But yeah. Larry is dead. D E A D. Yeah, I appreciate all the subs and follows from Twitch and YouTube, though, guys. I might stream later. I don't know yet, though. Because I'm trying to do a sleeping schedule, too, and I've kind of been sticking to it. But yeah, I don't always play games like this. This is just like a once in a while type thing, you know? I don't really have a main game, I should say. Sheesh. Yeah, part two. I did a uh, part one um, a few weeks ago, if you guys want to watch that. Um, but like I said, I have played season one and I've watched the other seasons. But I, I am going to beat season one on streams or videos or whatever. But I don't know about the other ones. I probably will, to be honest. I probably will. But um, I don't have the next seasons yet. But yeah, I'll probably finish season one. Oh my god. But yeah, this was fun. Um, if you guys want to start watching me, I'm going to be doing a bunch of smaller games, random games, uh, as YouTube videos on the 22nd. So if you guys want to start watching me, um, tomorrow would be the time. I don't know what time I'll start posting. Um, but yeah. Because I still need a uh, an editing software, and that's what I'm getting tomorrow. So then I'll actually be able to like post the videos. Um and they should be in good quality, should be in 1080p. Um, but yeah, I stream pretty much every single day on YouTube and Twitch. Um, like I said, uh, I just want these streams for like games like The Walking Dead, you know, campaign games. I want them to just be in their own stream. I don't want to stream other stuff before I play them or after because then it's just like, you know, for YouTube, whenever I switch to a different game, I usually switch the thumbnail and I switch what game I'm playing. So it's like if I do that, then I have to go back and change that. I just don't want to. But yeah, I appreciate all the subs today. I appreciate the likes on YouTube. I appreciate all the follows on Twitch. Um, like I said, I stream every single day. I have pretty much all my social medias. I don't post that much on TikTok, but I have that. I have Discord if any of you guys want to join. I know I have the link for Discord on Twitch. I don't know if I have it on YouTube. Um... But yeah, I have pretty much, I have Twitter too, and I have Instagram. I don't post on Instagram really. But yeah, um, appreciate the support. Um, I appreciate anybody that's going to watch my videos. Uh, hopefully they're entertaining enough or good enough. But yeah, I'm nervous. <laughs> but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. And peace out.